Thank you for tuning in to the Lazy Hiker, where we plan to show you the dopest watering holes in California. To start off this season, we plan to focus on a lot of watering holes in the Northern California, focused around the Bay Area. We're talking about the outskirts of Yosemite, all the way up to uh, Marin County, down to Santa Clara County, all the good you know, I don't know if I can cuss on YouTube, but anyways, so today we're going to start off super low key. We're talking about a roughly 50 minute drive from the Bay Area. We're talking about Sonol Ohlone Wildness Regional Park, aka Little Yosemite. If you type that up on Google, we'll be able to get you a 50 minute drive out there. The hike is roughly a 30 minute hike, hour round trip, mile to mile round trip with three watering holes. This is the dopest part. You got the lower, mid, and upper. Labeling like McLeod, if y'all ever been there, trust me, that'll be on the YouTube channel a little bit later, maybe this season or the next one. Um, there is a $5 fee to get into the park, $2 per pet. So if you bring in the whole basketball crew, you already know you're cashing out. Make sure to like, share, subscribe, follow on the YouTube channel, follow on the Instagram. I might do the TikTok, who knows? and make sure to read the website for all the step-by-steps, how-tos, anything to look out for, and my recommendations. But for now, enjoy the show, and I'll see you in the water. So as I mentioned, it's a $5 fee to get in the park, two bucks per pet. Keep in mind to bring cash, because they do not accept ATM. If you continue down the paved road, you'll eventually get to Little Yosemite. There's ample parking spots. Granted, it might not be all paved. You'll probably get some in the dirt, but the entrance isn't too far off. I normally park further out because there's not that many parking spots at the beginning of the trail. The super lazy hike, as I mentioned, 30 minutes, 213 feet elevation gain, so nothing too crazy. Once you get to the slot, stick to the right as that's how we get to the bottom of the river. Make sure to be careful because the rocks are slippery due to loose gravel and you do not want to slip into the still water ponds that they're around because trust me, they're disgusting. Welcome to the lower falls. There's two waterfalls. They're five to seven feet high. Nothing too crazy, but you could tuck in and chill, get soaked up on a warm day, and it feels amazing. This is the biggest part here at Little Yosemite. So if you got a big crew and y'all just trying to chill, have some fun, slap some music, relax, this is the spot you want to be at. The water's pretty shallow, roughly three to four feet deep, not too crazy. So you definitely, you know, scrape over your knees if you're swimming up in that mode. You know what I'm saying? You might be able to see some fishes, some frogs. We even caught a bobcat up in the hills one time. Hence, it's called Meow the Bobcat. <laughs> In order to get to the mid falls, you want to climb back up and exit the lower falls. Keep going up the river between these two trees, which I recommend is the easiest way to get to the mid falls. Around to the left of this big boulder and you're there. So these middle falls are probably the most popular falls here at Little Yosemite. The best part is falls that they're so secluded and tucked away in the corner that you've got your own little pool. This is the deepest area. I want to say it's probably like five feet deep. It's still not too crazy, four to five. But if you hike up the river, you'll be able to get to the top of the falls and you can look over Little Yosemite the River River. It's a dope little spot to chill at. I've seen people jump off this, but I wouldn't advise it. The 
Upper Falls are located two to three minutes further on the main trail. It's the same type of situation where you see a lot, stick to the right hand side and you'll get down to the river. When in the river, stick to the left portion because it's the easiest to navigate without getting in the water. Welcome to the Upper Falls. These are the last little Polish area that we have at Little Yosemite. It could definitely be your personal spa day because it's so chill. The water feels great on your back when you jump in that pool of water and just coast. recap of little yosemite so thank you very much for tuning in make sure to clean up after yourself keep the area clean for the next lazy hiker that goes up on the trail i'll see you on the next one